the Marathi cinema came back to the very first subject that Indian cinema was launched with, namely Raja Harish Chandra. Made in 1931 as Ayodhya Charaja, it was directed by V. Shantaram. Besides having songs sung by Govindra Thembe and Durga Khote, it had a very strong expressionist influence of the early German silent cinema. Undoubtedly, the most powerful example of such an aesthetic is Sant Tukaram. This film made in 1936 at the Prabhat Studios and directed by Fatil Alad Damle manages to capture the powerful bhakti movement which Sant Tukaram managed to encapsulate. This film captures the earthy realism of the saint poet and blends it beautifully with his mystical journeys.